Have you ever been in a relationship with someone who just wasn't good for you? Maybe your relationship was like baking soda and vinegar, explosive and reactive. Dating can be an absolute minefield at times, and it can sometimes be hard to know what to expect when it comes to meeting new people. To help with this, here are some things you might want to avoid when entering a new potential relationship. Number one, emotional dumpers. As the title suggests, emotional dumpers want a relationship for one reason alone, to have somebody whom they can dump their emotional baggage onto. If you're dating an emotional dumper, then it's likely that you will hear about every problem that they're facing in life and you will have no choice but to endure listening to this on a regular basis. If you try to suggest a solution, they will likely not listen to you. They tend to be in love with their self-pity and misery. Take time to think about how much emotional dumping you can take before continuing this kind of relationship. Number two, overly clingy people. Are you dating somebody who constantly calls or messages you? There's a difference between being eager and being clingy. People are clingy for various reasons. It may be due to insecurities or previous relationships that lead them to overcompensate because of fears that you may leave them. They may also have expectations regarding romantic gestures from you, which they will be upset about if you don't meet for them. So if you're a person who appreciates personal space and independence, it might be wise to avoid this type of person because you may feel suffocated in the relationship. Number three, the extreme perfectionist. A perfectionist is somebody who has the constant need to strive for perfection, even if it hurts the people around them and stands in the way of forming healthy relationships. Perfectionists often flip between two main emotions of dread and relief. If you notice that the person you're dating is difficult to please, always looking for flaws or problems, and they always wanna be in control, then they could be exhibiting signs of an extreme perfectionist. Number four, the narcissist. This is probably the thing which comes up the most when talking about who not to date. Generally speaking, narcissists are self-obsessed, judgmental, and tend to be very selfish. This type of person can be particularly draining as they wanna create a perfect image of themselves and their lives and want you to follow along with this. You will rarely meet a narcissist who will show any level of genuine empathy towards others. They also never admit they're wrong or accept their mistakes. And number five, the toxic communicator. Ever heard somebody you're dating say, I fight with you because I love you. Chances are you could be dating a toxic communicator. These types of people will find it hard to give you respect. Instead, they will argue, counter argue, and never give you space or an opportunity to explain things. This type of person may measure your love by how much disrespect you'll take from them. So do you agree with the points we've mentioned in this video? Remember every relationship is different. These are just general signs you may wanna watch out for. Always listen to your instincts and think about how you feel around the person you're in a relationship with. If you found this video helpful, like and share it with friends that might find insight in it too. Remember to subscribe to Psych2Go and hit the notification bell for more content. All the sources used are added in the description box below. Thanks so much for watching, until next time.